Hi Nomies and welcome back to another video. Today I am coming from the door um, and I will be giving you guys a craft room tour and showing you guys my sticker organization and sticker storage and stuff like that. So let's get to it. So this is the overview of the craft room, which is also, it was made for the dining room because it's right next to the front door. Obviously, we don't use the dining room, so we use it as a craft room. So this is my setup here. <clears throat> All these drawers and these two um, foldable tables, shelves going up, and we got a bunch of stuff. So let's start behind me because we've got two little sets. So these sets of drawers, all the ones I'm gonna show you are from Amazon. So they came in, we built them all, and they have done a glorious amount of help with organizing this room. So this one is full of magazines and newspapers and stuff, and then over here is just a random miscellaneous drawer of markers. I got kind of all types of markers in here. Um, sometimes I use these, um, but Usually that's for like projects and stuff, like for school or something. But on top we have some colored pencils, just a couple, just a couple. Um, and then we've got this giant coloring page that my mom um, works on sometimes. And then this is like the little paint ink kind of station. Um, we've got a giant bin of inks and sprays that is also inks and sprays. I'm pretty sure, I don't know, this is my mom's stuff. I don't really touch her inks. Um, paints, some glue, some acrylic pour painting stuff, uh, more paints, just like paint, okay. And then my mom put some of her cool, um, <clears throat> paintings up, and that is me in my pajamas, so. So anyway, so those are like the acrylic painting things that she does, and those are kind of everywhere on the wall. So then we're going over here, which is kind of like the area that is most used um so this bin is kind of or this set is basically my mom's so we've got two rings of her washi tape um i don't use that washi tape i'll show you where i use what i use my washi tape um in but we've got her posca markers um and we've got just a bunch of delusion and diane reevely stuff whether they're like plain chipboard books or uh full books or there's all that kind of stuff we've got some stamps um, some fabric like it's just pretty random. I don't label the the drawers just because I know where everything is already and there's no point of me labeling it. It might be helpful for anyone else that comes here or something but there's no point to be honest. I don't really care to make you know those labels. So then we've got the second um, set of drawers which is basically my set, at least on the right side. So on top, we've got some tape. We've got my little basket of cutouts from magazines or cards and stuff, or just random cutouts. And then we've got a Jane Davenport um, paper pad, and then we've got some Art by Marlene stuff. We've got my giant binder full of stickers, which I will show you in a second, and then my Delphonics pouch. And then on the left side is more like tools and like glue and stuff. And then this is like some string. And say hi, Dad. Hi, Dad. Okay. And the, we put the string on top because you guys know my dogs and they will eat whatever. And then on the right side, this is like my set of drawers. So let me sit down in my chair from Amazon. Oh my gosh. Okay. Almost fell. So we've got, this is kind of like, I don't even know how to organize this stuff. So we've got some pouches. We've got a dashboard. We've got another pouch. We've got some uh, traveler's notebook covers. Um, we've got some traveler's notebook paper. It's kind of just a messy drawer in here just cause I don't know where to put this stuff. But um, I will be using some of this. I mean, you guys see me sometimes use my traveler's notebook paper to set up in my home in two weeks and stuff, but yeah. Second drawer is full of chipboard stickers. I love chipboard stickers, but I don't use them too often anymore just because they bulk up uh, the journal a lot. So, but yeah, these are from Freckled Fawn. These are all from scrapbook.com. 
So there's that. This is also another kind of miscellaneous drawer. I've got my sticker, I mean my sticker, my paper pads, like my favorite paper pads in here. I've got some random, I got a washi card, I got some paper clips, it's kind of random in here, some stamps, and then some stickers I was given, so it's random. This is like my seasonal drawer. We've got some 4th of July, Christmas, like it's just, yeah, all right, like random. Um, I know it's messy, but it's okay. So there's that drawer. This drawer is full of all like alpha stickers plus other stickers I need to go through and organize. Like look at these funny stickers that I found. Look at these stickers. Those are like old school, like vintagey looking ones, huh? Those are kind of cool. So those are out the door, basically. We got some notebooks, which um, I talk about in like my the beginning of my channel. I kind of went through all of, um, well, a lot of these journals. And then we've got another journal one with my old planner and my toes. <laughs> this drawer is full of scraps. This drawer is random as well, and it's won't come out but that basically is like my case for my my ring light it has my fitbit case in there it's just i don't even know then this drawer is full of halloween stuff because i have so much halloween stuff that it needs its own drawer so there's all that so that is basically my my set of drawers i don't know see i was the one who built these drawers and that's why they probably suck so anywho okay let me get back up. Okay, so going back to the binder. So this binder is from Staples, and so are the um, page protectors inside. But it's such a pretty floral pattern, I had to get it. So I tried to organize it as much as I possibly could. Um, I don't know. I need to label them with my tags again. But So we've got food. We've got... Um, words, word phrases. Um, these are like random icons I have. Um, seasonal, more seasonal. These are more icons. It's kind of random. Um, um, what is that one? More seasonal, I guess. More words. No, 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 no. This is summer. This is summer. Oh wow, oh, this is so bad. Okay, so summer. My gnomes. Um, five below, um, animals for the most part, or expressions and stuff. Um, cute is what I have it labeled. Um, more word, these kind of word phrases. Uh, I didn't know where to put these ones, so I just stuck them in my own thing. Some other words, flowers, labels, day by day, alphas more alphas and then miscellaneous so those are all the stickers in here um i'm not gonna lie i don't keep it as organized as i probably should um but i know the pages i know what stickers i have in here so it works for me so there's that any oh yeah and this bin is from five below by the way so there's that okay so we're going on to my desk now and then we'll go up so over here, we've got my mixed media um, art journal. We have this acrylic set of drawers that is from um, Amazon. And I have my Felicity Jane die cuts in there, plus some other vinyl stickers I have. Um, this is where I keep my washi tape. These are two sets of acrylic drawers also from Amazon. And they have like three rows in there, which fit perfectly for washi tape. I got this idea from um, Heba from My Little Journal. She has these and I love that idea. So I just put these kind of in color order, not really see like oranges and pinks and reds, like I, I try to, but I usually use these ones the most. This is like my favorite drawer. Look at all that pretty washi tape, I'm obsessed. So there's that. And then we've got my How to Draw Every Day book, my self-care health journal for 2021. Um, and then these are all from Amazon, those drawers as well. We've got stamps in here. We've got things that I can use as tippins in here, plus other giant cards that I don't know where else to put. Um, washi sheets plus washi roll. These are like my backup stickers. I have like a couple sheets of these, so until I like 
finish using one, then I'll pull out another one if that makes any sense. And then we've got my puffy stickers, and then this is kind of random. We've got confetti in there for when I package things, and then we have a gift from Alicia that I need to find a home for. Um, and then I have my paper cutter on top, <coughs> which I think is also from Amazon. This little basket is from Tuesday morning, and I use it as my everyday kind of go-to sticker. So I have all my Shine Sticker Studio stickers, my little reusable sticker book that um, Laura made me, um, these Pip Stick stickers uh, that Gina gave me, um, just some icons, some other stickers, like just random, you know, like cute little ones, you know? So those, that's what that little thing is. This little um, pencil cup is from Home Goods, and it holds all of my mild liners to one lonely pen. This uh, pen thing is from Home Goods as well, and it has all of my cool pens in here, all my new jelly rolls, my super tips, plus the ones that I can't pronounce, <laughs> um, my Tombos, and some other pens. Like it's just a fun little thing that I have all my pens in. So. Um, and then this, uh, first sticker storage thing is from, oh, that's actually, they are both from Home Goods. these, these two sticker organizers. So, we've got my paper pads back here, plus two sticker sheets, actually, no, three with my hair. We got some sticker sheets also, Simple Stories, the best, um, with my paper pads, my favorite ones. And then... Simple Stories sticker books, all of my Recollections books. Um, over here we've got some Agenda 52. We've got my 100 plus, or 1,000 a a thousand plus Agenda 52. Um, Sticko, um, Christian Designs, the, um, the, I know you can find this at Walmart, the, uh, like the Color Your Own stickers. Then Shine Sticker Studio and Wonton and a Million, kind of random. Um, but I went biggest to smallest so I could see what I have. Up in the front here, we've got three compartments. So I have some note-taking uh, books. This one is from Sugar and Sloth. And then um, this is from a party. It's a party favor, and it's just a giant to-do and to-fetch dog pad. It's so cute. I love it. Um, and then we've got some prayer prayer cards, basically. And then here we've got two little small sticker books um the super totally awesome sticker book from yubi and then this is like one of my favorite ones the mega sticker book icons by three birds design i forgot to link it down below in my last video i kind of just realized i'm so sorry so those go right there and then here is like i said this is also from home goods and it fits perfectly my american crafts sticker books plus my little die cut holder um I have, this is from Shine Sticker Studio, the little pouch, and then inside I have Shine Sticker Studio, Sparkly Paper Co., um, Sugar and Sloth, I think. Just some die cuts in there. Then over here we have Happy Planner, and then this little kind of bunch of mess is a, my favorite stickers that Alicia sent me that don't have a cover on them. So that is what this is, my favorite stickers. Go ahead and put that back in there. But we have all of my Happy Planner books. We have all my Craft Smart and then Recollections. My big rec Recollections book is right there. So I try to keep it as organized as possible with the brands. Um, so that's what that looks like. Love it. It's so easy to see what I have and go through. Also, it's right in front of my work area. So, um, and then we have my Ring Light. That is from Amazon. This pen. Um, caddy whatever you want to call it is from michael's and i've had this for a very very long time but basically it just holds all the random stuff highlighters post-it notes random markers and glue and scissors and this thing i could kill someone with random that is like my mom's kind of um organizer she has all of her schitt's creek and her stickers and stuff in there so that is like her little her little thing now we're going to work our way up onto the shelves. So here we have a little bin that I got from, oh, you can get this anywhere, but I think I got this from Walmart. I have my little, the Crafty Gnome Pocket that I'm gonna keep all my Hobonichi Wheat Kits in here. I have this, I have an extra, um, oh no, it's not. 
I have this Shine Sticker Studio uh, adhesive pouch that I hold all the business cards that I get. Oh my gosh, that I that I get keep in here. We have some watercolor brushes. We have an extra uh, pencil case and then a small paper cutter. Then we have all my books. Um, we have 100 Days of, of Grace and Gratitude uh, Bible Study. We have a, my first ever traveler's notebook, um, another traveler's notebook cover, and then some random journals that I have also. Baby wipes, and then this is my Canon selfie that I print my good pictures on, and then this is a little Dumbo that I need to finish coloring. So, Ugh, well, I'm so bad at doing that. That is from Christmas, and I haven't finished it. <laughs> This up here is full of random stuff as well. So this bin is from Walmart and it has a bunch of little bins that you can get from Michaels, Amazon, whatever, full of sprocket pictures, rings, ideology add-ons, like you put little labels on these ones, colored germs, a bunch of random stuff. And then a lot of random little things at the bottom there. And then we've got more pens and paintbrushes right there and a lot more pens. And then this bin over here is full of re, um, refillable paper, plus my mom's sprocket. So, and then up there is just more extra bins, my uh, photo album, and then all of my mom's beads. So those are the beads that I keep on the top shelf, um, and then fabric strips and this random giant red container. And then this is what I fill my videos on. It's a it's a gooseneck tripod that you can hook up like above you or or on your on your nightstand or something and you just pull it down and then it clamps your phone you can get that on amazon for cheap it's really really nice and it's not in your way and whatever it's above you so there's that um but be careful because i always manage to hit it and then we have more paintings up there and then we've got the windows because like i said this is a dining room so and then this acrylic, I mean, not acrylic, this set of drawers here is more random. I've kind of realized that we're very unorganized when it comes to this. Um, we've got Cricut mats, my book, my like schoolwork books, some copier paper, construction paper, coloring books, um, some blank canvases, a hand mold kit, um, some fabrics. And then this is like the, the general like computer area, I guess which is like the same, has the same Amazon chair and another foldable um, table. And that is our Cricut Explore Air like two or something. I don't know what it's called. Um, with the Cricut markers and my little scraper. And then these are our laptops that we use for whatever. Um, this is a drawing that my cousin made. And then we've got some other Nightmare Before Christmas stuff. And then our printer. This is like the boring part, but um, some other storage and some creepy mannequin heads and more paintings and then some hexagon things. Not hexagon. Yeah, that is a hexagon. So that is basically it for the craft room, the exciting part, plus my dog looking out the window. And then we have their dog crates here. So whenever you guys hear my dogs moving around and stuff, they're there or here. Oreo. Yeah, see? Anyways, so again, this is the overview. Oh wait, I, I totally missed the shelf. Um, okay, this shelf has this uh, digital frame, which I forgot, I forgot to turn on. Um, and then that Alexa, and then this is a bunch of glitters and like ink pads, and then back there are like some stuff that I never use. That's why they're so far away, unreachable. But yeah, so basically, I guess the sticker storage that I think you guys should try out is the binder is really nice if you have, like, a decent amount of, of stickers that you need to organize, but keep mobile, I guess. Is that the right word? Keep handy? I don't know. Um, or the acrylic drawers, or these drawer things from HomeGoods, but you can get them anywhere. So... That is basically it for the craft room. If you guys have any suggestions or questions or anything, if I didn't cover something, if I didn't, if I forgot something, I'm trying to think if I did or not. I don't think I did. Um, let me let me know down below. Bye, guys.